Previously. Hello and welcome, you amalgamated anteaters, to White River Watch in the middle of the air. That's good. <laughs> what? What's strange? Tell me now or I'll beat you again. All right, now if we could just keep from getting attacked long enough to set up camp, eh, Vilya? Holy shit. Oh, I got Whitbane. Great. There will be no dancing here. This is so beautiful. It is, right? Except for all the dead corpses littering the area. You are as good as dead. No. got lucky there, Vilya. What were you doing? Standing there the whole time? Oh, I see. You took out this lion. It's okay. Never mind. Alright, Vilya. Where you want to go now, baby girl? Baby girl, Vilya. Where you want to go, baby girl? Hey. Hey, sweetie. Sweet cheeks. Let's go this way. You got some neck seam, Vilya. We need to work on that. We need to get you a necklace or a collar or something. Oh. Covers that ugly neck. Alright, should we just keep following along the shoreline here? See what adventure lies in wait there? Alright, Vilya. There's going to be bandits up ahead. Are you ready for this? You certainly don't look ready. You look like you're about ready to curl up in an old rocking chair and start knitting or something. Here, we need to change that ugly ass dress you, you got on. You Here, wear well. some armor. Sure. Sure? My god, you're a fast changer, will you? I swear I didn't see a single nipple for even a split second. You don't have to hide behind a curtain or go to a bathroom or anything to change. You're just instantaneous. I like that. I like that in a woman. Instantaneous changing. Alright. Let's let's go ahead. Let's just keep pressing on here, Vilya. Alright, Vilya, where'd you go? Okay. Let's roll, Vilya. Let's keep traveling on. We got some bodies here. Oh, somebody's shooting. Aha. All the way from up here. Shit, that was a mess. I can already tell that was a mess. God damn it. You sneaky bastards. Oh, I see how you are. Yeah, that was a hit. One more of those. Oh, shit. God damn it. There we go. This is why I don't like using an Xbox 360 controller, but I'm in the other room right now and I have it hooked up to my TV in here. I have to use the Xbox 360 controller. I don't have a desk in here. Woodcutter's axe, iron longbow, don't need any of that. What is wrong with your hand, dude? Oh, okay. Just rigor mortis, just rigor mortis setting in. All right, who's next, Vilya? What are you What are you doing? You taking them out by yourself? Oh my God, there's a bunch of them down here. Holy shit! It's like a whole whole family reunion down here. Oh shit. took my head off. Alright. Let's go with some healing. Heal myself up real quick. You know, Vilya, this might be actually a pretty good place to camp out. What? What the fuck? Oh. Oh, hi. Anyways, this might be a pretty good place to actually camp out once we clear it of bandits. Um, there's probably a lot of places to sleep. And there's a cooking pot down there. Some food, that's good. Always good to have some food. So yeah, we might have to uh, hang out here for a while, will ya? What do you think, what do you think about this? You could, think this is the type of place you could call your new home? What do you think? You like it? You dig it, will ya? Every time I aim a little bit ahead to aim where they're going to be instead of where they are, they go the other way real quick. 
And I hate how they're able to just casually walk out of the way of an incoming bolt. You can just dodge bolts like it's nothing. I really want to know what the hell's going on in the water right there. That is weird. I'm going to have to go down and investigate in a minute. <clears throat> yes. Oh shit, I'm about to fall. My god, how many of them are there? Bandit Highwaymen, yes, yes. Just gonna keep moving on. Let's see who's in this one over here on this side. Oh, some dead people already. That's good. Medium buckler, pickaxe, uh, Viking heavy coif. That's cool, that's cool. Oh man, and because of uh, dynamic things, I can actually loot every single one of these barrels. That is nice, very nice. All right, I'm gonna keep moving on. End table. Some gold, and let's see what's out here. There's a, I think there was a bandit out here. Yeah, this person right here. I guess I already got him, or her. I guess I should say. Arrows, iron tonto. It's pretty cool looking. Spring steel short bow, and there's no image of it. That's really weird. I think I'm gonna take it. I want to see, see what this looks like. Well, it's, uh, it's not as good as my chieftain bow. Oh, it's invisible. Yes, I got an invisible bow. Brilliant. I'll never see it coming. Well, there's a mod glitch of some kind. It's pretty interesting. All right, I'm going back to the chieftain bow, and I'm going to go see what's on top of this thing here. What's up top here? Oh, I hear Vilya speaking all ominously, threatening some bandits or something. Yeah, a nice big bed to sleep in. Got a wardrobe up here. A little uh, end table. We might have to call this our home for a little while, Vilya. Make this our base of operations. Venture out from here whenever we go take care of stuff. Imperial short bro of burning. Damage is 75. Uh, let's see. We got 104 damage on that, but this does have extra burning damage. Let me see. Let me take a look at this thing. Imperial short bow of burning. Okay. Uh, burns the target for 10 points. Okay, so it would still be only 85 damage even with the extra burning damage. Vilya, where are you? Oh, Vilya! This is the end for you. Where are you, Vilya? I hear you bitching at somebody. Oh my god. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Person waiting right there. This is the chief. You oh shit. To see tomorrow. Oh yeah? Ah, uh, you're nothing. Weakling. Weakling. Gold. That stuff. The damage on this isn't as good as what I'm using, but it is silver and it looks so cool. I love the Sons of Skyrim hood. Because that's damage, prote that's uh, armor protection and uh, exposure protection in one. And a knapsack. Yes. I really like this boar heavy shield, but it's the same damn uh, armor rating and value as my current shield, and I like my current shield a little better. So I'm gonna stick with that. Where are you going after the really? Oh, these people down here? Still down here? I see them. Alright, I'll just come in a little closer then. How you like me now? Oh yeah, swim away little fishy, swim away. How about you? I'll take you right out. Alright, whatever. Come on, bandit thug. I'm ready for you. I'm ready for you, buddy. Give me your best shot. Okay, maybe not your best shot. Cause you're gonna kill me. Okay, thank god. Let's see what you have. Some gold, other boots, remail armor. That's pretty cool, actually. Ooh, steel longsword. Yeah, I don't really need any of this stuff. What is happening here? It's a book that's stretched all the way across the water. What the fuck? My speech craft is enriched. What would happen if I took it? Is that weird glitch con? Yes, it is. Okay, I've never seen a book stretched out like that. That's weird. You're an ex bandit thug. God damn it. Why are they all running away from me? What about you? Are you gonna fight me? Oh yeah, okay. Alright. Oh, you might actually be kind of tough. Maybe I should uh, 
drink some healing potions. Everybody right now watching and like all you viewers are saying, just level up, It'll, it's an automatic healing. I don't like to do that, I feel like it's cheap. Oh man, this guy is tough. He's really tough. Why are there two bandit chiefs? I already fought one bandit chief. What the hell are you playing at here, people? Oh god, I don't have enough magic. Oh, that's right, my magic doesn't regen because of that disease I have. Shit. Alright, I'll just have to try to crossbow this out, probably. I can't get in very close because he took down a bunch of my health with just one hit. So it'd be dangerous to get in too close. And they keep jumping into the water and swimming. God, that's annoying. Where are you running to, bandit thief? Don't tell me you're scared. Running like a little bitch. What the fuck is he doing? Alright, bandit chief, this is your last shot. Oh, it went over your head, of course. Well, this is your last shot. Well, that's not either. Oh my god, you're gonna kill me. Oh, you're gonna kill me. It's really great not being able to heal myself. Let's see if I have any... Magicka. There we go. I took one more than I actually needed to. That's okay. Come on, Bandit Chief. It's you and me, buddy. There we go. Let's see what this guy had. Bill, yeah, I need your storage. Oh, I might as well level up now. Okay. Um, my health is quite a bit higher than my stamina. I guess I'll go with stamina. I would go with magic, but you know, more of a more of a warrior character. So. Okay. So what should I go with? Yeah. A heavy weaponry, light weaponry, uh, marksmanship. I should probably start putting stuff on Wayfarer more often too, since she's supposed to be sort of a woodsy character too, and a hunter. Maybe I'll do that. Campfires burn 40% longer, while in the wilds you move 7% faster. Collect and place bear traps. Oh, that'd be really cool. Um, better knowledge of animals, and 25% 25, 25 more resistant against potions and diseases. Probably uh, awareness would be good. Being able to collect and place bear traps would be awesome. Bear traps have 30% chance of breaking when triggered. That's pretty cool. Alright, now I think there's one guy left, wherever he is. Is there someone in the air? What the fuck is that? Is there a giant just hanging off that bridge? What in the hell? How did I miss that before? Alright, I'm gonna go back up there. The water is cool and refreshing. Thank god it's not frigid. Oh. Bandit thug. And dead. Is that the last one, Vilya? What we got here? Nothing really very good. Is that it, Vilya? We might have to call this place home for a while, Vilya. I like it. It's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet place. Pretty nice little setup we've got here. We got our cooking pot. We got some beds up there. We got a wardrobe and an end table and everything. All right, cool. It says I'm wet. Yes, obviously. All right, so how are my needs? Oh, I really need to get that disease taken care of, that whipbane. Pretty bad. Um, I'm a little peckish, so I could probably cook something. And I'm wet. And I'm sober, I'm rested, that's all good. So basically, um, I just need to eat a little something something and find a place to cure this disease, which will probably have to be at a shrine because I don't have a cure disease potion. Or if I could get some hawk feathers, that would do the trick too. <clears throat> I don't know if I Let's go ahead and go for that. Make some more of that. What else can we make, Vilya? Some boiled mud crab? How about that? I'll go ahead and boil some water. Don't want any dirty water that'll give me a disease or something. Grilled leeks. Actually, as a matter of fact, while I'm here, I should probably fill some empty <laughs> bottles in that stream down there. What else we got? Nothing? What's in the misc section? Poison flare illuminates the target for 10 seconds. Whoa, that's interesting. Oh cool, I'm completely dry now already again. 
All right, now that we're done battling Vilya, I should probably put on my other group, my exposure protection what stuff. Makes this smell? I'm gonna go ahead and go down here and try to gather up some. I can bottle this water, right? I'm pretty sure I can. Oh, it's just drink from stream, but I can't, what, I can't bottle the water? I, pr I thought there was a way, I might just be forgetting. My mind might just be blanking out on me, but I was almost positive that if you had empty bottles and you were by a stream, you could just fill those bottles. I'm almost positive there's a way to do that. And for some reason, I can't remember how to do it. Maybe it's the same spell as drink from stream, but then if you're quenched, you just start filling bottles. Maybe? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Well, my mind's blanking out on how to do that. If any of you guys remember how to fill empty bottles at the stream so that you can then come back and boil them, let me know because for some reason it's not working. Maybe you have to, um, maybe you have to be by the stream and then select the empty bottles. Maybe that was it. Hold on, let me try that. Let me try that. By the stream. Go to... Where would it be? I guess maybe I don't even have any empty bottles, come to think of it. Yeah, I don't have any empty bottles. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. I have a bunch. River water gain. There we go. Okay, cool. That's how you do it. I'm gonna fill them all up. And can I also do... Like, do I have any flagons or anything? Oh, the water skin. I could do that. Sweet. Full of river water. Awesome. Filling them bottles. Oh, and now I'm over encumbered because the empty bottles are now full. Actually, that's cool and realistic and it makes sense. So, I was about to be frustrated by that, but I was like, hmm, if I really did just fill up, like, you know, nine bottles full of river water and then tried to carry them on me, it would slow me down quite a bit. Um, so actually that's pretty cool. Now if I can just get back here and boil them, but I'm gonna have to put them on Vilya's storage. Probably, in fact, I should probably do that right now and then walk up there with Vilya and then get them back from Vilya and then boil them and then give them back. Nah, that's too much work. I'll just take the slow walk back up. For some reason, slow walking is making me lag. <laughs> I don't know why that, how that makes any sense at all. All right, get to the cooking pot here and boil some water. Oh yeah. All right, where do we go? Where's the water? Here we go, boiled water. Lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of boiled water. River water, lots of river water. What about the water that's in the water skin? I don't suppose I can boil that too, so I don't have to, I mean, I don't wanna just have unsafe water sitting in my water skin. Here we go, water skin, boiled water, awesome. Okay, cool, oh, here we go, we can, Take boiled water and make water. Interesting. Very strange. Alright, cool. Well, we got a lot of water now, Vilya, and I'm gonna make you carry yes? it. Yes? Let me look into your extra storage. Sure. Alright, bag one That's will be wish. for survival. Bag two will be miscellaneous weapons I find, stuff like that. Uh, anything that I don't want to sell that I want to keep. Okay, so... Let's go over here. Actually, I probably could, shouldn't keep these on you because this is a survival thing and if I ever get to a situation where you're separated from me and I desperately need water, oh well. Here, take all the water. I'll give you all the water. All right, Vilya, you can have this boiled water too and this boiled water and... I don't know, should I give her all the survival stuff? Probably not, I'm gonna need to eat and drink pretty often. I should probably at least keep my water skin and some of my food. Um, and just give her maybe just some of this stuff. I just want to be able to walk, but I don't want to give her all the survival stuff. Because I don't think it's a good idea for me not to have anything. So, alright, I guess that's it. Billy, you want to stay here and relax for a while? Good idea. Alright, cool. Well. Come to think of it, though, I don't need to sleep or anything for a while. I really need to get this disease taken care of. What time is it, though? Uh, it's 2.57. Yeah, we got enough time, probably. How far is the Elder Gleam Sanctuary from here? Okay, there's the Elder Gleam Sanctuary. It looks like we're about halfway. Um, we probably won't be able to make it all that way without... Well, we might. I don't know. No, probably not. We probably won't be able to make it all that way before having to stop again um, and camp um, and get some food and some sleep. So, uh, But then again, it's too early really to have to camp out here now. This should just be our base of operations, but we should probably go ahead and head out because I think we've got enough daylight left, Vilya, to probably try to make it 
push on through to the Elder Gleam Sanctuary. What do you think? Uh, I got a few other things to do here, though, so you just relax for a bit. Check this out. Some gold in there. Well, okay, that's pretty much all I had to do. Oh, I want to go check out this crazy giant up here. I... Pretty sure I did not see this the first time I came through. I have no idea why there's a giant just sitting up here. I'll take this bear pelt, cave bear pelt, giant's toe, gold. I'll take all this stuff. Thank you, sir giant. I don't know what you're doing up here, and you're kind of in the way of yeah. my being able to get across. So I'm probably going to try to push you out this little window, and that's not working very well. Giant. Oh, you fucking asshole, giant. You're all up in my way. Just fall. Fall, asshole. Okay, Vilya, maybe this isn't the best place for us to call home, our temporary home for a while, our base of operations, because uh, apparently giants fall out of the sky here. But, uh, okay, that's okay. That's okay. Alright, well, I think I've already... Well, I'll go ahead and see what, what there is to loot in here before we take off, Vilya. Alright, let's head out of here, Vilya, and continue on to the Elder Gleam Sanctuary, so while well, we've still got some daylight left. And this will just be sort of our home base. Come back to here when we need to, unless we find something else a little bit later on. I can barely climb over that damn giant body to get out of here. Hello, Vilya, my pet. I've got some things for you. I see you're cooking up some nice food for us, it some home, home, cooked, home cooked meal for Don't us. You think so too? No, I think it smells like shit, Vilya. Let me see what you have made. Here you are. What is it? Apple cabbage stew? Oh, yeah, you're giving me more stuff when I'm already over encumbered. Thanks a lot there, Vilya. Okay, let's go. Of course. All right, cool. Now, Vilya, before we go, I need to check your extra storage sure. and give you a whole bunch of stuff that I'm not going to be using. As you wish. Sure. Well, let me look in bag two, because I'm going to just right. throw a bunch of miscellaneous stuff in there, I'm pretty sure right now. I don't know. We'll see. So let me put that knapsack on right now. I'll make this, I'll put on this Sons of Skyrim hood. And wait, what happened to my armor? Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Alright, Vilya, you ready to go? Ready to go, honey child? Let's head on to the Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Actually, let me save it real quick. I'm gonna save it. Save often with this many mods, it's gonna, it crashes a lot. I go, you know, I, I played a lot of these videos, made a lot of episodes in this series without any problems, without any crashes, and lately it seems like I'm getting a lot of problems so it looks like there's some lions down there and wait that's just great more lions all right Vilya let's head on to the Elder Gleam Sanctuary oh yeah got that lush trees mod making my trees look beauteous and the Skyrim flora overhaul increase uh, improving their textures actually I've got trees HD ultra um, overriding Skyrim flora overhaul on the trees what are you going after Vilya uh, I hope it's not a lion I can't even see what it is. This area is too wooded. Okay, apparently whatever it was, you took care of it pretty quickly. I have a bad feeling about this, Vilya. Oh, this must be what you just killed, huh? Tundra wolf pup. Oh god. I really hope these lions don't don't see us. That's right, fox. You better dance, dance, fox. Is that even a fox? Yeah, it's a fox. Okay, what is it? Oh god, I was right. It's lions. Ah, oh, fuck. What do you say, guys? Another lion cliffhanger ending? I think that would be good. Holy shit, there's a lot of them. Oh my god. 